Good morning, children. Once again, I am here with the topic periodic properties. Last term, I had explained what is periodic property, what is the reason for the periodicity, and I explained the atomic radii and ionization potential to periodic properties. Now, the next periodic property which I am going to discuss is electron affinity. Electron affinity. What is electron affinity? It is the amount of energy released by an isolated atom in its lowest state of energy at the time of accepting an electron. If you recall, then you will understand it is the just reverse of the ionization potential. Ionization potential, amount of energy required to release an electron from an isolated gaseous atom and here amount of energy released in its lowest state of uh, state to accept an electron by an isolated gaseous atom. That is why this electron activity is always represented with minus sign which means the release of energy. The definition wise you will say the what is electron activity? The amount of energy property the questions are specially based on the trend that left to right in periodic table what is the trend and top to down in periodic table what is the trend if we talk about the trend the electron affinity increases across a period means left to right and down the group in periodic table it is decreases. The factors affecting this is also quite similar. I already told you that two factors basically affecting all the periodic property. Nuclear charge and the number of shell or you can say atomic size. Nuclear charge means the positive charge present in the nucleus which is equal to the number of proton. I also explained in my last video that when we move left or right, number of shell remains same uh, but the number of valence electron increases. Similarly, if we move top to down, number of valence electrons remains same but number of shell increases. So, if we go there, the left to right in any one period, if you are moving, One electron and one proton is getting added. Means number of protons is increasing. That means the positive charge on the nucleus, which is we are saying the nuclear charge, increases. Due to this nuclear charge, it pulls the electron. It pulls the electron more uh, within the. 
greater energy. That is why electrons to accept any electron in that state require the more amount of energy and that is why the electron affinity increases because the nuclear charge increases the tendency to gain electron increases. Tendency to uh, <coughs> gain electron is because nuclear attraction increases and when the nucleus attraction increases the more energy release at the time of accepting because energy is increased in outer shell the energy is more required more and that is why more energy is required okay so the electron affinity is increases decreases why because the same thing number of shells increases means atomic size increases top to down nuclear pull becomes less that means outermost shell has the less energy and that is why less energy released at the time of accepting electron so the trend of electron affinity is that the top to the arms from bottom it decreases left to right it decreases next periodic property is
also number of shell increases the nuclear the valence electrons becomes far from the nuclear so nuclear pole decreases because number of uh, electrons valence electrons or number of protons are remaining same so nuclear pole decreases and the, that is why attraction power decreases so electron affinity also decreases so this trend is very important children which property which side increases in the periodic table and which side decreases that on the most of the questions in your um, this chapter is asking based on the trend only and the last periodic property which you have to learn that is Thank you. 
Tendency to gain electron to form the negative ion. Metal character tendency to lose electron to form the positive ion. The reverse is tendency to gain electron to form negative ions. Talk about the factors affecting C nuclear charge and number of shells. Nuclear charge increases, that means the pull of the nucleus increases, and that is why the electrons are easily accepted because nucleus is already attracting, so easily it will be accepted. So, non-metallic character increases means that it will be accepted easily. Similarly, the top to bottom nuclear charge is same but number of shell increasing means pull of the nucleus is less. So, it will be difficult by an atom to accept the electron. So, the non-metallic character Based on the trend is 
marks. So if you remember this chart and compare that which one is increasing, which property is increasing, and which property is decreasing across a period and downward group, then you can able to get the answer. So uh, last video I explained few periodic property like this, and this is the complete chart to compare each periodic property and their trends. So I hope it will be helpful for you and you can be able to attempt the questions. Thank you. Children.